Well, hello again from Argentina. Uh, I want to give you your Proverbs of the Day. Yesterday you heard from Brother Kevin Hall. God's using him in a great way, and there in South Africa. Hope you can go visit him sometime and see what God's doing. Proverbs chapter number 23, verse number 23. The Bible says, Buy the truth and sell it not. Also, wisdom and instruction and understanding. The book of Proverbs was written to teach us wisdom. And here in this Proverbs that we see today, the Bible says, Buy the truth and sell it not. You see, there's some things that we've learned from, from Pastor Gardner, or from Pastor Trent, or from other people, from reading our Bible, and there's certain things that you've read and you've learned during these weeks. And the Bible says when you learn it, grab it, buy the truth, and don't sell it, sell it not. You see, the honest truth is a lot of times in school or for friends or for something, we, we get tempted in a certain way, and the Bible says, you know what, we don't need to sell that. In fact, the fact is that many times when we get the truth, then we say, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to church, and I'm going to serve God, and I'm going to read my Bible. And then someone starts making fun of us for being a Christian. And then we sell it. We get rid of it. But you know what, Christian? We don't need to get rid of it. We need to stick to it. And I want to challenge you. You know what? Get some beliefs. Get something that you believe in. Some, some strong convictions or some purposes in your life that are true and that are real and that are biblical. And I want you to write those things down. And I want you to say, you know what? Now that I'm a Christian, I have these convictions, I have these beliefs, and I'm not going to sell it. I'm not going to sell out. I'm not going to be a little wimp. I'm going to be a Christian all day, every day, every day of the week, all of my life. I'm going to serve Jesus Christ, uh, my Lord, with, with all my life. You know, and I, I remember when I was young, I made some convictions. I made some statements in my own life, and I said, God, you know, I'm going to do the best I can, and I'm going to be pure until the day that I got married. And God, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do that. And I remember a lot of times in my life, after games or whatever it may be, that I had a lot of temptations. But you know what? I thank the Lord that He allowed me to stay pure and to stay strong to my, my convictions. What I believed and when other people made fun of me for what I believed and they called me names, but I stood to it. And I challenge you today, grab a pen before this finishes and before your day ends up. Grab a pen and write down, you know what? These are some things that I believe. These are some convictions. And don't sell out. If you get the temptation or people make fun of you, don't sell out. Be a strong person, and one day God will be using you so that you can do great things for Him. God bless, and have a great day.